son mujeres pobres, sin posibilidades o muchos recursos para este, denunciar, para defenderse. En essence, Ciudad Juárez and other border cities have been transformed from being centers of, of uh, small scale of violence to a uh, gigantic scale of violence in, in, in recent years. Most women that I talk to have heard about, I mean, they don't use the word femicides, but Juarez is recognized throughout their region and certainly known in other parts of the country as just being an extremely dangerous place. We ended up thinking that there was really only, only one human rights abuse, and that human rights abuse is poverty. And you see that poverty at many levels. You see uh, poor individuals inside of communities, poor communities inside of a state, and poor nations inside of the world. And at each level that you see this poverty adds another level of violence. <laughs> The murder of the girls is a symbol, but the reality is this city kills people. This is a violent city that doesn't feed its own people, doesn't educate its people, doesn't protect its people, and that slaughters its people. I think there's one high school for half a million people in the war, for example. Ciudad Juárez, el ser mujer y ser pobre es un blanco perfecto para que puedan ser asesinadas y, y no pasa nada. Thank you.